the mayor's attack. Just after the war, City 31 reached out to nearby resistance networks to help keep the peace. The insurgents belonged to a cell in the Shrike network. That network provided security before 31PD existed. They left when the Global Council cleared aliens and hybrids for return to society. Mm, couldn't stomach protecting the people they fought in the war? Seems that way. Since 2037, they've kept to the outskirts and swapped war stories at their watering holes. Sounds like a dead end. Maybe. Something drove them to carry out this attack. Keep your eyes open. So, we are still investigating the... Um, what are they? The progeny? Yeah, the progeny. The progeny. Sorry, the progeny. Good. Um, let's see. Agent Scars. He's blunted, which means his crit chance has been reduced. That's not good. He, he likes to crit. And you over here, you're also blunted. You also have your crit chance reduced. That's also not good. These crit chance reduction has to go as soon as possible. Then we completed module armor. That's pretty good. Enhanced armor would be amazing. But that's something we can't do at the moment. Um, because we're missing... Ooh, breach explosives. Breach tactical equipment. These could be very, very good. These will give us amazing upgrades. If we breach a room. Mm. Enhanced pistols could be good. But I do really want to do the enhanced armor first. Uh, because our people are pretty squishy. Usually we can do good damage with the people, but sometimes a nasty shot comes in. And we want to protect against that. Now, um... Equipment or explosives? Probably equipment. Then, uh, training-wise, your HP increased, good. Um... No. So he still has his basic conditioning up. Axiom has his basic conditioning done. The blue blood still has to do basic conditioning. Okay. I'm actually thinking of doing basic conditioning for blue blood, but because he is kind of squishy. And then afterwards, we could maybe think about doing um, the marksmanship thing. So you are going to be on the conditioning duty. Then, in the team, we'll definitely be Zephyr again. We should do a spec up. If we are going to put Chirrup in, then Verge can do a spec up. And what is it that we need most at the moment? I think it's Illyrium. So he's going to do a sting operation. Ooh. And then armory. Don't we even have... Let's check. No, we don't. We have no additional items for these guys. That's fine. And he doesn't need to be repaired at the moment. That should be fine. Now he got the scar, so that's that. Assembly does take four damage the days, and let's take a look at what there is to do. There are two missions. There is a story mission available. The story missions, uh, you shouldn't progress too fast in them. Uh, they do give you good rewards, but they will also make the game harder. And uh, we have always... Ooh, armor piercing rounds. We have always failed because... Um, uh, but the Lurium is probably worth also quite a bit. Ooh, this is... I'm actually thinking about doing the Illyria mission. We do have the... Oh, but this will also reduce Unrest by 2. And looking at all of this, we will probably have to do this like this. Um, We also want to put in some more field teams, so... Let's talk about over here. You over here, you will have a technology field team. Good. 
And if we have four or two or more in total, and we're definitely going to do a mission over here. Let's put another intel team over here. So then we can at least do quarantine, freeze district unrest. How long will this take? Uh, block unrest from rising in the target district for two days. So we could either put it on one of these. Yeah, we should put it on one of these. This will trickle up all the time. So this would only um, remove two unrest. But if we put it like over here, these won't be doing anything. And um, it could be that this mission is here more than twice. So this will be on the quarantine now. That's going to be good. Also, we reached 8,000 views today. Uh, we actually breached it during the uh, Factorio wave assault, um, uh, wave defense scenario. And I didn't really have the time to... to... Oh, the scavenger is about... Oh, dang it. Uh, advanced autoloader. And the autoloaders are usually pretty, pretty good for people um, that are in melee and shooting nonstop or for people that are in constant overwatch. Then again, yeah, we're not going to buy it just now. Then again, people who are in melee all the time usually go into melee if they do not have to shoot again. So we're not going to go into scavenger market. We are going to do um, the search mission over here. Uh, it's again, uh, all these missions will always be very difficult because we're playing on legendary. <laughs> and this is a search mission. I have no clue what the search mission is, but that should be fine. Send in the APC. So, oh, wait, 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 wait. We have items. We have to. Um, who's coming with us? You're coming with us. Load out. Make items available. Yes. What do we have? We have a medkit. You get a medkit. And the reaching charge. And over here, Zephyr, you get a bang. So. One mission, one door, one keypad. Very difficult. Oh, I think search is just, I think, a shoot to kill mission. So these are perfect for that. Let's go! Device located. Destroy that target. That will be easy. Breach mode! So, um... A side door is a door, isn't it? So, if we put action over here... No, if we put action over here... I actually put you... The roof. Yeah, here he will do his thing. So that will be good. Then... Either fearless advance. Mana team can go in over here. Let's see, the first unit true gets plus one armor for the rest of the encounter. And entering through here marks your units until the end of the encounter. So they're actually... Only he will be going through there. And the first unit over here will be marked. We could make Xavier go through. And chirp, and he will throw... Can he throw something? Doesn't seem to be the case. Can maybe chirp go first. Then Xavier. Then Terminal. I think this is fine. Breach and clear. Breaching in. He sounds so nice. He doesn't. <laughs> I really enjoyed how he just breaks through that door. Oh, this is a terrible positioning. Well, might as well shoot at the sorceress. Because... Oh, weird. Perfect. Trade us at once. Acolyte or the resonant? The resonant. Then over here, you could shoot the acolyte. Good shot. Oh. Either the sorceress. Definitely the sorceress. Oh, good shot. Then 
G goes over and kick! <laughs> I completely missed that kick. That kick is so amazing. This is also a pretty hard map. Um... I have the target. Disassemble that thing. Okay, reinforcements will be coming if we do not disassemble this thing. There are no reinforcements coming this round, so this round we will be focusing down people. Um... Then again, Chirp over here, he will... No. Yes. Chirp over here will be placing his shield on... Oh, he can't even see her. Then put it on Axiom. Because he's marked. And then you could either shoot... He's probably going to Overwatch, isn't he? You're going to Overwatch. As she directs. There we go. Ah, oh, we missed. Uh, suplex, really? So every time his shield gets broken, his uh, personal shield, shield charges up. And that allows him to do more damage. Now, over here. I should probably throw a flashbang grenade at, me, uh, at some of these people. There's a hitman sitting over there. There's also a bruiser sitting over there. Can we get these two? No. Uh, the sorceress. The sorceress is the most dangerous of them all. And she will be going first. Just go over there. Kick the sorceress in the face. Good, she's out. And then you go into parry mode. Time. Target weapon in play. Now, is somebody hurt? A bit. How good can you shoot him? 56% chance. If we move up, it won't change because we can't even flank you. You're sitting in a more or less good position. Uh, you could heal up. Some of them. You could also throw your cease... Oh, yes. Definitely throw your ceasefire grenade. And again, maybe not right now. We could prepare somebody. We should prepare somebody. We could get Zephyr up. No. Could you? No, oh, it seems we can't. We can only... No, wait, this is preparation. Sorry, never mind. This is the skill I'm looking for. <laughs> yeah. Get her up again. So she can take out the Aqualite. And we can think about... Well, Chirp will be shot. Definitely. So, patch up Chirp. On the way. Nice thinking. And then you shoot him because he's standing out in the open. Raised him? Ah. Okay, you're up. Uh, punch him. Shattering. Ow. <laughs> and then activate your parry. I kind of put her in a terrible position. No ammo. Oh, you're out of ammo? You can dash in and hit the resonance. To be the target. He's out. So now reinforcements are coming in. Now we should try to start to shoot down uh, the machine. That's a problem. I can't see the machine from over here. Can at least take out the troll. 
Well, let's at least do that then. Fuck him. Disabling target weapon. So you can shoot the machine. That's good. So you should... You should move a bit. Move, say... Can we still see the machine from over here? Quite sure. I can see something from over there. Yeah, you should be able to see the machine from over there. Uh, will this thing explode? Confirm. You can kick the machine. Smashing extremity. Uh, and then move away. On the run. You need an escort? Closing in. Target in sight. Oh, don't go on the rage bender. Reload. I need to reload even. Well. Weapon full. <sighs> Reload. Go in rage. Shoot the machine. Yeah, that will be fine. Burnt. You're literally on fire. At least now, no reinforcements will be coming in. Even though we did kind of uh, burn Verge a bit. You can shoot the Hitman from over there. If we're going closer, you can probably shoot him even better. So let's do that. Yeah, take him out. You definitely patch up Axiom. Let's get your insides back inside. You should also stop burning with this. Yeah, perfect. And then you're going to overwatch. I'll shoot anything that moves. Safe here. Um, this will cause burning for you, but I think you'll be fine. I'm roasting here. Ooh, weapon disabled. How oh, nice. And she can't. Well, then run over there. Fast as I can. You'll make it. He is going in the rage band. That's one way of doing it. So, Axiom is only wounded. That's good. Rating is excellent. We have only an 80% chance. I actually wanted to capture him, but he kind of got shot. But that was a good mission. And we also got the armor piecing round. Um, unrest has risen. Unrest has risen. Unrest has been lowered. Good. Oof. And we have a promotion Three available. PD arrested two humans and a sectoid for removing their dampeners at the promenade. The arresting officer downplayed the psionic disturbance. Oh, we this was a political didn't even have his first promotion. Nothing more. A protester on the scene disagreed. The dampeners are painful. We should be able to live as naturally as anyone else. Channel 37, Celio Dash reporting. Uh, we're going to reduce the uh, unrest over here. So that this can trickle over a little bit more. Uh, currently, there's only one mission we can do. It's one of these two. We can either get some credits or some intel. I'm actually thinking about getting some credits. Because we should be good on intel. But that's something we will have to see. Supply technically, um, and yeah, that's 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 good at this. And I'm not quite sure what what the uh, upgrades are going to cost, the enhanced shotguns and the enhanced armor. If this is going to be something that we have to pay with money, or pay with Illyrium. so that's something we have to find out. So 
So, um... Oh, wait. Either money or... Yeah, we're going to take the money for now. It's always good to have a little bit of money on the high cash side. Uh, Intel is something we always will be getting. Not actually quite sure if we got any Intel on the last mission, but we do have two of these, and these will give us 10 Intel every Friday, so we're getting 20 Intel every Friday. Uh, we're also getting 15 credits every Friday and 10 aluminum every Friday, so credits it will be. Send the APC. Yes. Unrest in Renewal Heights has lowered. Oh, that's over there. I'm Floyd Tesseract, and I'm part of the reason you lost your world. I was an architect of the invasion, as much as a slave to the elders can build anything. But I broke your world. You didn't know how to fight back, to think for yourselves. Well, you better start, or someone else will do it for you. And who will you blame this time, hmm? I'm Floyd Tesseract, and I'm here to show you why you should have believed. <laughs> I do like the answer. So we will definitely be getting his marksmanship up. Getting in. Do we have somebody else who still has to do his he's sure has to do his basic conditioning. So I, I, I rate basic conditioning higher than uh scar training. So that should be fine. Which also means we probably have to give you some new items. Uh, load out. Make all items available. Yes. For the pistol, we have the targeting system. Oh, we also have the scope available. Ooh. Reaching charge, yes. AP rounds. Ignore five points of armor. No. I think the AP rounds is something that's good for, um, for the guy with the shotgun. Because the shotgun does the most damage. And then we have the advanced scope. Uh, you have a submachine gun. You have a handgun. You don't even have a gun. Uh, so you will be getting the scope. Nope. Oh, didn't want to do that. I think that's going to be fine. Good. 